one day I was 16 years old. Is that right? No. It was Willow Shields. Damn it. Definitely B. Cheryl Burke. God, what a gangster she is. Oh, gee. Queen of the ballroom. Just kidding. I'm just talking about myself. Huh. How many seasons does Cheryl have to do before she's a judge? Hey guys, so Dancing with the Stars season 30 is officially underway and a lot has happened since I joined the show way back in season two, a long time ago. In honor of this milestone season, I decided that I should play a little game of Dancing with the Stars trivia right here today to really test my knowledge on how well I know the show. But not gonna lie, I'm pretty nervous. Especially after so many years, I feel like a lot of the details have started to kind of blend together in my mind, but I'm gonna do my absolute best. So let's get started. I guess, okay, let's get started. Who was the youngest contestant ever on the show? A, Sean Johnson, season 15. B, Zendaya, season 16. C, Willow Shields, season 20. And D, Bethany Moda, season 19. Crap. I'm gonna say Zendaya was 16 years old. Is that right? No, it was Willow Shields. Damn it! God, I wasn't on that season. Next, who was the oldest contestant ever on the show? All of my partners, no, I'm kidding. A, Wayne Newton, my partner, season five. B, Cloris Leachman, season seven. C, Florence Henderson, season 11. D, Tommy Chong, season 19. Florence Henderson? Cloris Leachman. Okay, um, so yeah, so. Cloris Leachman was 82 when she was on the show. Can you believe that? Len Goodman must have wanted to come out of retirement when that happened. Um, and for those of you that don't know her, she is best known for the Mary Tyler Moore show. Rest in peace, Cloris. We love you. It's, it's actually really sweet, but Dancing with the Stars, like Florence Henderson passed away. So what they do is they put a star on like anyone who's ever been a part of the show on the actual dance floor. So anyone who may have passed, and definitely Cloris' star is there, shining bright, and she always made, made me laugh, so every time I see it, she puts a smile on my face. How many seasons have you been a part of? A, 23 seasons, B, 24 seasons, C, 29 seasons, D, 21 seasons. I'm gonna say A, 23 seasons. I was definitely on the show consistently from season two through 19, then I broke free, kidding, took a break, and then I returned for basically season 23, Missed season 24, I know this is confusing. Then I was back for seasons 25 through 29. Okay, which partner did you get your highest average score with? A, Lachey, B, Gilles Marini, C, Ryan Lochte, def definitely not. D, Juan Pablo de Pache. Gilles Marini, which is actually quite shocking. I thought for sure it'd be Juan Pablo. And guess what? Both Gilles and Juan didn't win. Craziness. Okay, how many celebrity couples were on season one? I know this one. A, six, B, eight, C, 10, D, 12. That was a small season and the answer is A, there were only six couples, a part of season one. God, I would love to just to have six couples. It must have been a lot more like intimate and fun and less competitive, but who knows? That'll never happen. The bigger, the better. Um, okay. Just so you guys know too, Kelly Monaco, my good friend, she won season one. And then for season two, they were like, oh, we're on to something. There were 10 couples. And then that was when, after season two, was when the show went twice a year. So starting Emmett Smith, which was season three, then we did two a year. Then in, we, in between, we went on the road. We were on tour. Didn't have a day off, loved every single second from what I remember. Which professional dancer has been on the most seasons? A, Darren Huff, B, Cheryl Burke, C, Mark Dallas, D, Peter Murgatroyd. Definitely B, Cheryl Burke. God, what a gangster she is. Oh, gee, queen of the ballroom. Just kidding, I'm just talking about myself, third person, that's weird. Anyway, just so you guys know, as I said earlier, I've done 23 seasons, holy crap, holy. Tony Davalani, miss ya. 21 seasons, Mark Ballas, 19 seasons, and Derek Huff himself, 17 seasons, and he's a judge. How many different hosts have there been on the show? Permanent hosts, not counting guest hosts. Well, that's good. Okay, A, six, B, four hosts, C, five hosts, or D, seven hosts. Um, okay, so there's Tom Bergeron, there was the first co-host, I forgot her name, and then we have Samantha Harris, Brooke Burke, 
Aaron Andrews and Tyra Bakes. Six, ding, ding, ding. Who is the only pro to have won both DWTS and Strictly Come Dancing? A, Gleb Savchenko. Wow, I didn't do that better. Gleb Savchenko. Savchenko. There you go, you have to say it like you're about to sneeze. B, Artem Schwinz. Oh, Artem, I've known Artem the longest, still can't say his last name, but who cares? He should only be known as Artem. Or C, Karina Smirnoff. B, Artem, question mark, Shigvinsev. Definitely have no Ukrainian in my blood. Okay, sorry Artem, I just murdered your last name. Anywho. Um, so basically Artem won Strictly Come Dancing season eight. And then finally, long overdue, he won last season of Dancing with the Stars with none other than Caitlin Bristow. Okay, and now he's Emmy nominated. Congrats, Artem. Which of the following partners did you get the most tens with? A, Juan Pablo de Pache. B, William Levy. C, Gilles Marini. Or D, Drew Lachey. C, Gilles Marini. I remember we got like tens. Like, honestly, they gave it out like way too soon, but we got like so many tens. Let's see how many tens we got. Okay, we got 21 tens. We still lost. But basically, Juan Pablo. You know, we got 17 tens, William Levy, 19 tens, and Drew, 13 tens. How many winners of the 29 seasons of Dancing with the Stars can you name? Okay. Kelly Monaco, Drew Lachey, Emmett Smith, Elio Castroneves, Apollo Anton Ono, Nicole Scherzinger, Chrissy Yamaguchi, I'm doing this out of order, Caitlin Bristow, Amber, forgot her last name, from Glee, the girl from Dirty Dancing, Jennifer Gray. I'm just trying to name all of Derek's partners, right? Isn't that how it works? Because um, I won back in 1960. At least I can still remember that. Um, okay, oh, Melissa Rycroft won All Stars. Zendaya won with Val. No, that's Paul. Eh, eh, wrong. It was Derek, actually, that won. I'm missing, oh wait, hold on. Rob Kardashian should have won, but that didn't happen. It was Karina's partner, forgot his name. Great, Gerald. We forgot. Okay, so I got like what, 10 out of 29? I forgot Donny Osmond, Brooke Burke, duh. God, Sean Johnson, duh, that was my, there was two that were traumatizing that I'm still going through PTSD. It was Sean Johnson season when I danced in Gilles because Sean won and when Bobby Bones won and we didn't even make the final, we didn't want Pablo. God damn it. Thanks for all your questions. Not gonna lie, I'm actually pretty impressed with myself. I didn't think I remembered that many of the details, to be quite honest. So, I mean, except for most of the winners. Sorry, guys. Um, but at least you got that mirror ball, right? Let me know in the comments how many of these you knew the answer to, and if you think this is fun. And maybe we should try another type of trivia right here on my channel. So let me know what topics you wanna see me try. If you like this video, make sure you give it a thumbs up and please subscribe to my channel. Our new videos coming every single week. Can't wait to see you all very soon. Until next week, sending you love and light. Bye.